Now some terrifying video of a couple swarmed by a pack of pit bulls in their own backyard. This was not an isolated case. A mother was also surrounded by the same pack of dogs while she was picking up her children at daycare. As Les Turrent reports, there have been four police reports filed against the dog's owners in just the last few months. Sheer terror as a pack of pit bulls attack a couple on their patio. Sarah Cook and Ryan Lesher scramble for safety as a dozen vicious dogs swarm around them snarling and biting. As they flee indoors, the pack runs off, searching for more victims. I was sure that we were going to die. We were pretty much pinned against the wall. One jumped up and bit me right in my abdomen immediately. I wasn't sure if I was going to survive that, but, uh, but we did. We're here. Sarah and Ryan had planned to hold their wedding on the patio. Now they say they're too scared. We just bought this house and it should be such a happy time for us and now we're afraid to be in our backyard. Incredibly, just 10 days later, the same pack of pit bulls attacked a mom of three as she picked up her kids at daycare in Indianapolis. Look at them circling the car, round and round. The traumatized toddlers are safely inside the vehicle, but their mom is bitten on the feet and ankles as she screams for her life. She says the dogs reminded her of the hyenas in the Lion King movie. My kids are screaming and what was probably lasted 30 seconds felt like 10 to 15 minutes of pure torture. It's National Pitbull Awareness Month a time when pit bull owners try to improve the negative image of the controversial breed. This year, the effort has been marred by pit bull attacks that have left three children dead and two seriously injured. The owner of this pack in Indianapolis does not seem to have gotten the memo. After the latest attacks, the dogs were finally removed by animal control. The couple who are attacked want the county to limit the number of dogs one person can have so incidents like that 